Okay, so Thimbleweed Park, it is by the... It is by old adventure game developers and artists and designers and visionaries from the early to late 90s of adventure gaming. The What would pe people would call the golden age of adventure gaming. Ron Gilbert's at the helm of this one. He needed a lot of other cool games that you guys may realize. If you don't know who Ron Gilbert is, this is not the venue for me to do that. Go Google his name. Uh, but Ron, Ron Gilbert is an adventure game G and this game is fucking fantastic. We've been on a really good, we've been on a really good adventure game kick recently. And I kind of want to continue that since we beat Ori in the Blind Forest yesterday. Thimbleweed Park, everyone. You guys loved the dig and you guys loved, you guys loved the dig and you guys loved, um, Kathy Rain. All right, Thimbleweed Park. I I know of the game, but I don't know of the game. Um, okay, so casual mode. If you're new to adventure games or you're looking for a quicker experience because life is exciting and there is so much to do, free tutorial included. If you're an experienced adventure gamer and you want all the puzzles because there's nothing more exciting in life than playing adventure games. Once you choose a mode, you can't change it without starting a new game. You can play in casual mode, then play again in hard mode and see additional puzzles. Wow, the first, uh, the first person from Mixer to ever talk in this chat. And I think I got trolled. How can I stream? <laughs> uh, okay. Um, it does. I love carbonated waters. We have the soda stream and then we also buy, uh, buy carbonated waters as well. Um, we don't buy regular water cause we have a filter. We have a filter on our faucet for that. But anyways, uh, let's do hard mode because I'm a G, yo. I don't know what I just said. Okay. So text above the cursor indicates uh, indicates an interactive object. Look at the key card. Interact with the character and objects here. Give commands to your characters by selecting verbs. Items your character has picked up are here. Simple commands start with a verb and end with the object with an end with an object or character. Object character, pick up key card, verb. So pick up key card. I did. Shut up, Div. Complex commands start with a verb, then an object, and end with another object or character. Second object character. Use key card and door. To review or see advanced interaction tips, select options, then help. There we go. You got an old school adventure game crash course 101. God, I need a new mic stand. This thing's pissing me off. Remember, if people want to donate, all the links are below, including a wish list of things. And if you buy from the wish list, they get sent to me. No, different alley. different person ooh okay <laughs> I like how the population went down oh that's awesome part one the meeting But yeah, no, that's a different alley, so totally different person. I think someone got dead. God, the artwork is, is amazing in this. You should go see a doctor. No, I thought you were bleeding from the mouth. I guess not. Okay, never mind. I fly halfway around the world and an odd note is waiting for me in my hotel room. It says to come to the bridge down by the river. <laughs> also, let me know. Let this me know. Looks like the place. I could really go for some Wiener Schnitzel after the long walk out here. Jesus Christ. Uh, anyways, um, let me know how the volume is for you guys as well. All right. 
So it does, um... Okay, cool. Yay! Alright, so QWE is the top row, ASD is the bottom row, and then, or the middle row, and then ZXC is the bottom row. Sweet. That's gonna make, make things helpful. Alright, I'm supposed to meet someone down here. Have you seen anyone? I am supposed to meet oh. someone down cool. here. Cool, it's voiced. Have you seen anyone? Do you have any whiskey? Sober up, sir. <laughs> I'm glad Chuck is dead. Ruined my life. Excuse me? Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. <laughs> I just wanted to do it a couple times and see if anything would happen. I have to go. Sleep well. Alright, uh... Trestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park. 1.7 miles. Oh, cool. Right-clicking will also... It also... Okay, cool. It's, um... Context, it'll be context sensitive as well. Nice. I wonder if I can use this rock to put out the light. Wait, what are... Maybe I should look at the note. Boris, I'm glad you've decided this is the right solution to our problem. There are eyes everywhere to, to, to follow these steps. For your own protection, leave your ID in your hotel room. Check. Go to the river down by the, the trestle trail bridge. Check. Turn off the light above the trestle, the trestle sign so I know you have arrived. That would be why we need to, uh... I wonder if I can use this rock to put out the light. Oh, that's why we need to, uh, do this. Okay. <laughs> just break shit. We're not turning off the lights, just fucking break it. That yeah, works. I've completed step three of the note. Now for step four. It is my wallet, and it is my wallet, and it has 252 American dollars in it. In the 80s, that's a, that's a lot of money. Secret path? The fuck's going on? Okay. This is long. Okay. Excuse me? None of us were pre pre prepared for what we'd find that night. Or how much it would change us all. Part two, the body. It's like a it's like a TV show, but in in much smaller chunks of episodes. Okay. And those are our two main characters, and that's our dead body. The German guy. <laughs> so tell me again why you're here. I was assigned to the case by the home office in Albuquerque. There is no home office in Albuquerque. It's neat to know. Uh. Look, I like working a case alone. I especially don't need some junior agent messing up my investigation. Especially some junior agent that thinks I don't know there isn't a home office in Albuquerque. So stay out of my way. Take a lot of notes. Sit back and learn. And I'll wrap up this case and we can both get the hell out of here. Your reputation certainly precedes you, Agent Ray. I'll take that as a compliment, Agent Reyes. It's how it was intended. I'm sure it was. Let's photograph the victim and head into town to talk to the local sheriff. The body <laughs> is starting to pixelate. <laughs> body starting to pixelate. Is that, a, is that, a, is that an in-joke? be a long night. That's an in-joke, apparently. Because I, I saw, I swear I saw something about in-jokes. In annoying in-jokes. I don't know if that's a good or bad. An, 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 an annoying in-jokes, in or out. I can't tell. Well, anyways. Let's see if he... Trestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park. 1.7 miles. The bulb's broken. All right, so now we have our two main characters here. a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. You can tell by the pixelation around the nose and neck. Let's uh, see here. There's no wallet in his pockets. We were robbed! But I found a card. Possibly a key card from a hotel. It's an instant camera, 
It's an instant camera. 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 Okay, sorry. There's no film in it. All right, so appears to be a male approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. Nothing in his pockets except a hotel key card. There appears to be a small hole in the back of his head. Organs unknown. Origins unknown. <laughs> Whoops. There's a, there's, a small, there's a hole in the back of his head. Organs unknown. I meant to say origins. Oh, uh, excuse me. Ah, the hole in the victim's head doesn't look like a gunshot. More like a puncture from a sharp object. His suit looks tailored, possibly European possibly a European design. All right, so we can't swap people. Uh, she'll, so she'll have the same notes. It's a sample package of Polaroid film. It right. only contains one. Happy to help. <laughs> Happy to help. So how can I switch? Okay, so number one and number two, just quick switch the quick switches them. It's an instant camera. Only has one picture left. Smile. What white thing in the hot bar? Now we can head into town and find the local sheriff. Okay. Yeah, okay, look. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream where stupid shit gets said all the time. Oh, hey, look, our bum's gone. That's the highway into town. Yes, I know. Let's go that way. Do I, do I need to bring her too? I have to control both of them. I can't just... Well, I can double click at the very least and she'll run. It's an empty can of Crockford's tuna heads. The good parts. <laughs> can, I just, can I take the heads? Why do I have... Why do I need this tuna can? Fucking adventure games. I don't see anything up ahead. I think the town must be in the other direction. Oh, oh, oh. The signals are very strong tonight. What signals? The signals. The signals are very strong tonight. What? Yes, you already said that, but what signals? <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. Dark night. Deserted road. Me in a giant pigeon costume? It was too good to pass up. But the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. Sure, we don't get taste, 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 but we get these crazy fuckers dressed up as pigeons. So, I mean, <laughs> give and take. Come on. Um, you almost ran over a federal agent. That's a felony. You almost ran over a federal agent. That is a felony. Sorry about that. Like I said, the signals are very strong tonight. This is really odd. Should I save my game? I wouldn't worry about it. The <laughs> game was expertly designed to have no dead ends or death. Yet still be scary and have a sense of tension. You can feel safe exploring whatever you want. But I'd watch out for the signals. They can be very strong and disrupt the power grid. This game's too meta. This game's way too goddamn meta. Do you know anything about the body by the bridge? Why is it whenever a dead body is found, suspicion always falls to the person dressed as a giant bird? <laughs> it's in the cadet training manual. Uh we don't know anything about a dead body. But the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. Okay. Why are you dressed like a giant pigeon? We're the Pigeon Brothers Plumbing. I'm Beth. That's my sister, Emily. Hi there. Why brothers if you're sisters? Dad was expecting to have sons. And he was too cheap to have the van repainted. <laughs> so he's wrong with it till he's dead. Oh, soon. Shut oh. Up, are you killing your father? Nice chatting with you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Nice talking to you, too. Click, click, click. Beep. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Boop. The fuck is wrong with them? 
Beep. Beep. Squeak. Whoa. No time to talk. We need to figure out the signals. <laughs> you seemed really determined. I'm sure you'll figure it out. <laughs> I said click, you click, two are nuts. Was. Okay. Oh, cool. I can just hold down the mouse cursor. That's actually very helpful. Okay, and then they take the fuck off, apparently? Sure. Who's very strong? <laughs> you guys are having way too much fun with them. Apparently, we are now... Uh, we can go straight to a cemetery. Alright, well, a cemetery exists, apparently. We need to go to the sheriff's office, and I still don't know why I have a goddamn tune again. It's an empty soda bottle. Okay. Fucking apparently we're picking up the trash. What? That's also very creepy. What? No, I can't. Wait up, eager beaver. Oh, I can, I can. It does, I guess, here, but no. It's one or the other. It says Main Street. It's dark, but I can see there's nothing in there. Uh. Willie's Watch and Violin Repair Shop. Very specific. Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We repair watches and violins for the rich or famous. <gasps> the fuck is wrong with you guys? Closed. Looks like they cleared out in a hurry. Prestige. Something. Realities. Realties. For rent. Ride the boom. Bust. Ride the bust. <laughs> 